Greetings people of YouTube, it is I, Warsaw Matt, and today is a special day. Uh, the Rogue One teaser has been released. This is going to be slightly different because I am going to literally watch the trailer, talk, and then I'll talk to you, okay? That's how it's going to work. This is going to be a bit different, okay? Uh, I hope you like the sound as well because I've connected up my uh, USB mic as well, so you can hear me a little better. So that's nice, and it's always nice to hear what's going on, yes. Okay, so here we go. Oh, I love Star Wars trailer music. Forgery of Imperial documents, possession of stolen property, aggravated assault. Resistance. I like her already. On your own. <gasps> oh, it's the admin four. It's the control room. And undisciplined. This is a rebellion, isn't it? Oh my god. Oh, god, yes! Oh! Classic stormtroopers! Aha! I rebel. Mombothra! We have a mission for you. <gasps> oh, yes! Oh, lordy! Oh, it's a little claxon roll. Yes, go on! <gasps> who's that? That's not Thrawn. Why are you not Thrawn? Ooh, who's that? Who's that? What will you do? Who are they? Ooh, they're going. Oh, you this do? is hey, going you. to be... Oh, yeah, go on! Yes! Oh, <laughs> this is going to be so good! You Ooh, to what's going on? <gasps> Impressed. Mm -hmm. Okay, that was uh, j just a bit intense. Um, initial thoughts. This is going to be absolutely brilliant. First thing I'm going to say is that, despite um, what people have, yeah, you know, what we've seen of Star Wars in the past, what I love about this one, it actually feels like. A war story, you know, Star Wars, you know, um, classic stormtroopers. I mean, I mean, the, these bad boys are back. Um, and if if the current regime of Star Wars is anything to go by, these are going to be some be some severely hard bastards. You know, maybe they can actually shoot straight and not walk into doors. Ha ha ha! Naughty Matty. And. I just, I just, I love what I, what I love about new Star Wars is the scale. They've really, they've really gone for pu really big spectacle. But the thing about this, what I love even more, is that it's clearly set before Episode Four. I mean, we're talking by the looks of it, they were constructing the Death Star, but they were putting the the, um, the emitter on the super laser. This is going to be... I oh, just wonder what's going to happen, you know. Is, is Vader actually going to be in it? We've heard some rumours. Um, it does make me wonder, because in New Hope, you had Grand Moff Tarkin, played by Peter Cushing. Now, Peter Cushing, bless him, no longer with us. So it makes me wonder how they are going to work round this. I mean, obviously... Um, Luke and Han and everybody else they're out there doing their thing they don't come into it until the end of episode 4 so there's plenty of room for new characters but my Mon Mothra is in there Mon Mothra you know last time we saw Mon Mothra was Return of the Jedi and I like I like the way that they found someone that looks very much like her that's what I like I like that I like that a lot I love the attention to detail. I love the way that they constructed the rebel base on Yavin 4. Oh, that's just a bit nice. What I'm really looking forward to is the fact that it teases at the idea that this is how they got the plans for the Death Star. But we're not just talking a little Cobalt mission. This is a move, this is a story on its own, a Star Wars story. This is gonna be integral to possibly the entire Star Wars canon. And I, I'm so psyched for it. I'm so psyched for it. Um, 
by the looks of it, we get a Grand Admiral in the white uniform. A Grand Admiral turned up first in Air to the Empire by Timothy Zahn. If anybody wants to go see the review of Air to the Empire, the book Air to the Empire, um, I've done a review for that. I'll put a link in the um, in the doobly below. So go and watch that as well. Uh, fantastic book, fantastic set of books. Timothy Zahn, uh, absolutely amazing writer. I'd love to meet him. But anyway, I'm getting sidetracked. Uh, I would. L it's a shame that it's not Thrawn, because that's the one thing that fans have wanted to see since the announcement of new Star Wars was the Grand Admiral Thrawn. And he hasn't turned up yet, but I, I think that one day he's going to turn up. Maybe it's going to be in a series. Maybe it's going to be... Maybe they'll bring him into new books. That would be so nice. That would be so nice if they just brought him into a book, just, just to see him. Because it was those adventures that kicked off new Star Wars. Because after... If it wasn't for the new Star Wars books, after Return of the Jedi, it probably would have just died. Okay? But, anyway, that's a side note. This teaser serves one purpose and one purpose only. To make fanboys' loins moist. And this has happened. See, I thought I was excited um, when Force Awakens, all the trailers started to come out for that. I'm really psyched for this. It's in December as well. December must be the new month for Star Wars films. Um, I fully intend to have the midnight screening of it. So anybody wants to come with me, please do, because it's now fun going to a cinema on your own. No, I'm just, oh, I am just so psyched for this. This is so cool. So yeah, uh, what's the matter proves? <laughs> <coughs> Excuse me, still dying. Uh, <laughs> so yeah, that was. I just wanted to put my two pounds worth out there. There's no point to be sitting there describing everything. What it's the fact that it's going to fit into continuity. They've got they've got the look of everything so perfect. I mean, I don't know how they do it. I really do not know how they do it without physically going back in time and just taking the set from there and bringing it forward and just adding new lights. Uh, we've got new characters. So where there are new characters and a new film, there's going to be new books. Ooh, oh, spending money that I haven't got. Never mind, who needs money? It's just money. <laughs> so yeah, uh, Star Wars Rogue One trailer is out now. Watch it, make your own mind up, but I can tell you this, I don't think we've got a worry in the world. This is so good. This is just, yeah, it's on the money. It's absolutely spot on the money. So yeah, Warsaw Matter proves of the Rogue One teaser. Stop.